สวัสดีครับ Hello everyone my name is Maggie and this is another episode of RC Modify in this episode we're gonna be assembling the M Drift 2 chassis We have all the hardware and the 3D printed parts. I haven't cleaned them yet. I'm gonna do that now. You see these guys? These are meant to be broken off if you want to use the space. If I'm gonna use this engine, I'm gonna have to break these off. There's a little bit of glue here. I'm gonna use alcohol to clean it up.
We are pretty much done guys. I'm gonna use a lighter to get rid of some plastic hair.
silicone crease.
make sure it's tight first. And now try to make it move freely. And now unscrew a little bit. Here I have the shocks, but the springs are too soft. Here I have new springs that are a lot stronger. I'm not gonna use the screws that come with the shocks. Don't tie this all the way, make sure it can move.
I'm gonna be using channel 5. On this side, the hole is right on this line. And on this side, the hole is on this line.
these are engine mounts and of course you have to remove this one when you put the engine in these are the body posts if you don't use this one right here you can just use the straight one but if you're using it you will have to use this one And I'm about to show you guys something really cool. Don't screw this one in too tight, otherwise you will break the magnet. Double-sided tape. Copper foil tape. With this setup, you will have up to four wires to run to the body. And now I'm gonna do the same thing for these ones. This right here is for testing guys to show you how it works. Thank you. 
And now what we need is a body. We only get one light like this. this right here guys is a white body super Mark V from RC Supremacy. If you want to find out how Brad made this awesome drift body, you can check out the videos on his channel. The links are in the description. <laughs> okay. Need new wheels. Let's put some racing seats on it. I'm gonna use this switch as a clutch. Thank you. 
Now the lights. I will put positive and negative here. Forward and backward signal, left and right signal. Yeah. It's time for some LED lights. I got a bunch of rectangular LED lights. So you guys gotta ignore the numbers on the plastic parts and follow the diagram exactly like that. I'm gonna use tape over the paint and use glue gun to secure the LED light. It's working guys! I'm gonna add another servo switch on channel 4 for the LED light. So having just one wire cut off is not good enough guys. It was twitching a little bit as you can see because I have one wire cut out and the other wire is still there. So I want two switches to cut off both wires. Next, we're gonna put these on.
I'm gonna add a voltmeter on it just to make it cooler. I'm gonna adjust the position of the caliper. The front wheels are perfect inside the wheel wells, but not the back wheels. This is a spacer set for the wheels. I'm not gonna use these, I'm only gonna use these ones. I have to trim this off a little bit. I have to trim this off a little bit. So somebody just told me that this right here has a gyro built in. So all you gotta do is turn it on. I have to reverse it.
have it guys, an M-Drift 2 chassis with a Supra Mark 5 body. It will be listed for sale, everything will be in the description. I hope you guys enjoy it and find this helpful. Thank you and have a nice day. Sorry cup.
the barn, I shut it down. Get on my section, don't bother with lames. I'm watching these bunnies bounce. Show to your ten, the rubber band, come off with a hundred power. Holler the talk, but don't run a mouth. I'm trying to be out. All I really wanna know when we leaving. All I really need to know is when we.